Hi, my name is Donovan, aka Double Donovan, and welcome to the Nameless, Nameless Journey <laughs> Podcast. He was too late to say it. So basically, <laughs> I want to say that we are on Spotify and Apple Podcasts. If you guys want to check out the full extension of the video, it's going to be about an hour. You guys can go on there and check it out. I'll put it, the link in the description. If you do like the content that I post, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and like and comment. And when I'm being by comment, I mean go ahead and ask questions so I can ask all of my guests here that I have here today. Speaking of guests, so let's go ahead and introduce my guests. I have the person that's one of my friends, Vanessa, aka Moonbe Popsicle. We call her the pretty Percocet because she really pretty, but she act like she off a of perk. And we also have Kai. No Kai one has Land, ever three called eyes. Me that. It's all right. I call you that. So basically, <laughs> that's pretty Percocet. One? We call her that Moonbeam Popsicle. So, and then we also have Kai Land, the man, the myth, the legend. Three eyes, Kai Land. Hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> So how are you guys doing before. today? Me neither, but I'm okay. doing great. Um I'm doing great. I woke up, got ready, and came here. Indeed. What about you, Kai? I'm doing great too. You know I always have something to say. Um <laughs> really So different. basically can I get you guys the morning routines first off? <laughs> My morning routine depends. It's either I wake up at like naturally at like six, six thirty. I get up, I stare at my ceiling, and then I get up, you know, brush my teeth, wash my face, skincare, do my hair, and then I, like, come down the stairs, pull, like, like three or four shots of espresso, make myself a brown sugar shake and espresso, and then I see if Kai's awake, he's never is, and then, um, <laughs> he never is, and I'm then... Awake. <laughs> That's the thing, I'm awake, it's just sometimes I, we, I probably, <clears throat> this is me in the morning. When I wake up, I'm just like this. So sometimes I just stare at the ceiling until God tells me to get up. So yeah. I get up. And then I like go to the gym. <laughs> and then I like go to the gym and just, you know, regret every decision. Like, why did I have to exercise a pizza or something? And then... <laughs> Not to regret. Sometimes. Or then my other morning routine. <laughs> my other morning routine is I wake up at like 9, 9.30, 10, and I also see if Kai's awake, and he is. And then we send like a selfie of us, like, just woke up. Just woke up in the bed. Type stuff. Like, bed head, bed hair. And it's okay. And then I get ready for the day, obviously. Okay. I'm going to tell you my routine Talk yesterday. Yesterday, I was mm -hmm. telling you all about like this um protein, and I guess it has energy. My mom told me about, I don't think I like these. <clears throat> <laughs> my, my mom told me something about this uh this brand called thrive and it supposedly has like a lot of energy in there too but i did that put some um bananas in there peanut butter and some honey blended that all together mm, it was scrumptious and Indeed. it wasn't thick because i don't like protein shakes or like anything that has like thickness to it and it's just like did you add ice to it at least or no no it's just like really cold water mm. and i just like chugged in it was pretty good okay yeah, and then I had a good day after that. We were supposed to go to the gym. But what happened? Honestly, my body just said no. I wasn't feeling it either. My body said no as well. But what if Beefy the Buff Man Slayer was there? We switched we gyms. Sw <laughs> we so switched let's go ahead and talk about Can that Can we thing. cancel? We, li we literally did cancel though. <laughs> we switched gyms. Okay, so tell the story behind that. Why'd you guys cancel you guys' gym membership? So why'd you switch to a new one? Personally, it's just because like, dude, with the... The membership that she had got too, it's like if we just like split it down the middle, it's like $10, 10 $15 cheaper. Yeah. And it has an upstairs, downstairs pool, tennis court. There's just like a lot more amenities and like more space to like move around and mess around. You know what I mean? Also, we're like very like loud and like obviously like it's great to have your own space. And like I feel like the gym we're going to go to now, you can like grab equipment, take it here, take it there. You can like do whatever you want. And they said they're going to put, yeah, there's like... Hacker rooms. There's tons of space, like when there's no like classes going on. And they said they're going to put in like turf and like a new sled and stuff. So you can like push a sled around and stuff. So there's just like more room to move around in, I think. And there's like more equipment. More room to have fun? Yeah. Yeah. Type <laughs> stuff. But um, honestly, in the gym that we're at now, it's cool and everything. It's, it's nice. just like, yeah, because it's not busy most of the times at all. Mm -hmm. But it's just like... So it's yeah, like, it's so top of yeah. Each other. yeah, and it's just like one little space, and I want to like move. I want to go swimming. I want to <laughs> shower. 
They have saunas. <laughs> yeah. They have, like a fat jacuzzi too. Yeah. You can like relax your board. <laughs> yes, mate. But what's your morning routine? My morning routine? What'd you do this morning? Morning reveal. <laughs> I woke up, checked if everything was all finished with editing, and then made sure all my uploads is all uploaded as well. Then I woke up, made some breakfast. I always make myself something like some eggs, or I'll do like some chicken and rice type stuff. Are you like a savory person in the morning? You can't do like a yogurt? No, I can't. (laughs) Like a a parfait? Well, I'm not finna just wake up and be like, oh, I'm gonna eat a yogurt and call it a day. Like, but, boy, like, I, but like, you gotta think about it like this. You a girl and I'm a, I'm a full grown male. Or like an oatmeal. Well, yeah, oatmeal is some, something different because I'm like, like a sweet oatmeal. Like well, a sweet. well, that's something different. Oatmeal is like carbs and everything. Just waking up and eating a yogurt and then going to the gym. That's something different. That's I can't enough. do that. That's yeah. not gonna help my body. When I say yogurt, I'm like yogurt with like granola and like a piece of straw. Yeah, that's still not gonna help me. And a banana. Uh, that's still not gonna help me. That's probably just like an appetizer for the morning, huh? Yeah, honestly, that really is. Because I'm doing cardio and I'm doing weightlifting for like an hour or two. Yeah, and, I do, and I do heavy weightlifting. Yeah, we going to need some carbs in my system. <laughs> Huh, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh. I need some carbs. In my- <laughs> I need some carbs in my system, man. I can't be doing all of that. That's what I'm saying. So, what would you add in your oatmeal? So, what I do for my oatmeal, I do like uh one and a half scoops of protein powder. Throw that in there, and then I throw some that's peanut good. butter, and then I throw some raw honey. I just know it's so thick. No, it's not thick at all. I it's- just know it. You swear it is, but it's not. It's like <laughs> like putting a lot of water with well, yeah. your oatmeal. I like my oatmeal with thick, I'm not gonna lie. Mm-hmm, I put water creamy. in my oatmeal. I like creamy. my stuff creamy. Yeah. yeah. No, nah, pause. Hold on. No, 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 what? no, no, no. No, not like that. Not like, no, no, no. You like heard that. it here first. <laughs> no, 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 no. But I like my oatmeal to be like creamy and it tastes good, you know? So I put, I need to get my protein in. So I put the scoop of half protein in there, man. It's suspect. <laughs> that ain't suspect. No, no, no. That's just the truth. Okay. I just want to say as your um, side quest, um, this video is also sponsored by Nameless Journey Podcast. Indeed. We you are sponsored go. by Nameless Journey Podcast because we do not have a sponsor. But you see that we have a Celsius sitting right here in front of us. Celsius, you should go sponsor us. I might not have a lot of subscribers, but I do make some good content. Show Real know. talk. So go ahead and check us out at Nameless Journey Podcast mm-hmm. on Spotify and Apple Podcasts as well since we're speaking about Nameless Journey. He also does photography, so if you want to check that out, you should. Yeah, I do a little bit he of photography really on the side. Photos. Yeah, it's Nameless underscore Journeys Photos. You can follow that on Instagram. I'll put that in the link in the description as well if you guys want to go check that out. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so first off, since I told people to comment questions and everything, I have one person that did comment a question. If you want to go ahead and read that for me, what is the furthest you can push aspiration? You go first. You have you got it. You the got furthest I can push. Mm-hmm. In what way? Because there's a lot of different like routes you can take. I'm not gonna lie. The furthest I can push myself. If I want it, I'm gonna get it. That's just like the end of the story. Like, if I really like like lock lock down on it, I'm gonna get it at the end of the day. Like, there's 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 no other option. Like, I'm just gonna get it. There's no like no. I'm gonna have it, and I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get it. You know, the real talk. Like, there's, there's literally no other option. Like, when I actually want something, when I actually want, <laughs> when I actually want something, I'm gonna have it, and that's the end of the story. So, just know if like, um, if I don't, if I don't consider it that deep, then it's I'm not gonna get it. But if I really want something, I'm gonna have it. Like, there's no other option. That's just how I see it. <clears throat> What about you, Kai? You know, um, <laughs> real talk. Still trying to figure out what the definition of that is. Yeah. But the aspiration, on, like your or drive. Just the question. Yeah. Mm, it's mid. I mean, what drives you to do better? Let's talk about that then. What drives me to do better? Uh-huh. Um, I think it's just like not staying comfortable. Like we were talking about in the last podcast. Yeah. If, if you're not comfortable, I just like have to push myself to be like just do it just do it as far as the gym as far as the gym one. yeah because okay. i wouldn't have went really that's my that's your answer okay for that. for my answer i think that when it comes to me i'm always pushing hard regardless of whatever i want so it's like if i want something i'm gonna go get it and i talked about that in the other podcast with caesar 
that I did like little businesses and everything when I was little. Like literally I was mowing lawns and washing people's cars to go earn my first iPod touch. Like it's just like I'm always on the move. I'm always trying to get some money. Not like selling drugs type getting money, but like I'm just like trying to get some money on, on the side. Like I always okay. like I'm always gonna make a little side hustle that is gonna benefit me and also benefit other people. So like this podcast right here, this is a little side hustle. Uh even though I'm not making bank off of it or anything like that, but it's just like I could eventually, you know, I could turn this into a business if I really wanted to. So it's just like I'm always on the move. I'm always pushing uh, harder regardless of what it is in the gym, here, at work, in schoolwork, anything. Real. Real talk. That's a good mindset, though, because I really do see that you do push really, really hard. <clears throat> I really do, man. Shoot. Sleepless days. <laughs> it sounded like a little tears. I really do, man. I really <laughs> It's, t- it's so t- <laughs> I really do be pushing hard man I ain't pushing. gonna lie Look It's tough in the streets <laughs> It's cold out here Okay oh so gosh. I wanted to I wanted to show you guys Some like funny tweets okay. Alright bet. Okay so there's this funny tweet That I read It said My boyfriend is so loyal He doesn't even watch porn With any girls in it Oh So who gonna tell her first off <laughs> So who gonna tell Who gonna tell her first <laughs> Who gonna tell her first off? I just want to say that Delulu's a Salulu. <laughs> if it works out for you in your head, then okay, that's fine. But maybe you should check your boyfriend. Check his watch list first off. <laughs> Second of all, go check his, go check his, the phone numbers up in there. See if he has Tinder downloaded. Because this is crazy, man. I think man. it's going to be Grinder, not Tinder. Woo! <laughs> And if he got Pizza Hut as a contact, that is not Pizza Hut. It's not huh? Pizza Hut. Pizza? I'm, why do you have Pizza Hut? It might Hut be Pizza Hut. Contact. I'm giving pe- people the Pizza Hut number. Why do you have Pizza Hut your contact? Because <laughs> it's not Pizza Hut. It's, it's not. Why is it named Pizza Hut? It's name is something different. <laughs> I couldn't imagine that happening to me. I think i am put myself in that situation. I think I'd be so defeated. Like, you'd never see me. It would just defeat me. I'm not gonna lie. Honestly, that's so like that's your last day on earth that's, because that's crazy. No, I'm like running away. Y'all would never <laughs> hear from me again. <laughs> Wait, can I interrupt real quick? Yeah. Would you guys want to do some like tongue twisters? <laughs> <laughs> so what? Okay. Well, we're gonna insert it right there, but. <laughs> Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. <laughs> you say it, go. Uh, ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. <laughs> good, good, good. That's so, what? That's a good one. Okay. <laughs> this, <laughs> is a, this is an OG one. How much wood a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck wood? Chuck, <laughs> wood, chuck, wood, chuck wood? <laughs> Got Boy, what? What in the chit chat chit chat chit chat? How many words should check out of order? Check check out what? No, hold on. That, said, mm. No, in the audio that I'm listening to right now, you said how the hell should I catch that? That's what you said. No, I didn't. I said everything. You said how much should I check out of order? Check check out of order. How much words should I check out of order? Check out of order. He didn't say nothing. <laughs> Y'all, that was so. Run it back. That was run it back. Do it again. Yeah. I'm gonna try to do it for real. Go ahead. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck? Oh. Gotcha. See? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if it would? <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> See, that's what I'm saying. He wasn't saying nothing. And then he, she over here trying to defend him. Nah. No, he had it. Mm-mm. That was so good. Mm-mm. The only one that messed up was you. Mm-mm. Okay. <laughs> he did too. Okay, I have another one. All right, go ahead. <laughs> Belly bought a bit of butter. Oh, there's more at the bottom. Yeah. But the butter Betty bought was bitter, so Betty bought better butter, and it was better than the bitter butter. Ooh. I quit. Okay, do it faster. <laughs> Try to do it faster. Billy bought a bit of butter, but the bitter. <laughs> try not. I quit. No, 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 try. <laughs> Just try I made better butter, better better. Betty bought a bit of butter, <laughs> but the butter Betty <laughs> brought was better. So Betty brought better butter, and it was better than the bitter butter. <laughs> Look, I'm, Betty, I'm getting tired of you over here messing with this butter and everything. Shut up. I I'm think so- you should, like, cut out the butter. I'm not going to lie. Mm-mm. Cut out the butter? Cut it out. So, Betty bought a... Oh. <laughs> Betty bought a bit of butter, but the butter Betty bought was bitter. So, Betty bought but, <laughs> bought better butter, but it was better butter, better than the bitter butter. Wow. No, Betty needed to hop on a treadmill and lose I some calories I'm with all that butter. I just because... <laughs> Just because I'm a little dyslexic, I feel like I can just read it faster. You guys are like, 
I don't know. Maybe this like it's that homeschooling you. No, <laughs> no. Get me out of here. <laughs> I I think. What do you think, Kai? I low-key felt like I was speaking in a different language. I'm not going to hold you. That made so much more sense than, like, actual reading right there. Those tongue twisters you gave me. What? <laughs> you does it? Like, it had more flow. Like, I could read that easier than, like, a book sometimes. Did you understand what it was about? Yeah, she had bitter butter, but she wanted better butter, so she bought a different better butter. But the butter wasn't bitter enough, so the butter could, could get the butter in the witch. Could you? Okay. Okay. So okay. I just that was a good one. Tongue twisters. I had it. Good. Don had it. Y'all had it. He did. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I guess. Oh, y'all had it. Yeah. I didn't have nothing. I was done. But you had it. By the bitty. The better. <laughs> butter. Betty Crocker? Betty. Uh-huh. Good. I was tired of her. <laughs> okay, so first question I wanted to ask you guys. It was mostly for oh. Vanessa. What's up? I want you to explain to the audience what girl math and boy math is, because me and Caesar talked about that on the podcast yesterday. So go ahead and explain that to the audience. Girl, floor. girl math is like, Mike let's closer. say I have a, mm, a $50 gift card and I spend $60 at the store. I spend $60 at the store. Um, I only spent $10. That's girl math. Wait, can we go back? To, can you re-say that? Let's say I have a fifty dollar gift card, right? Okay. And then I go to the store and I spend sixty dollars. I only spent ten dollars of my actual money because the gift card covered fifty. Very true. Let's say there's an item I want to order online, right? Listen, Linda, there's a order. There's something I want to order online, and it's the same thing, but one of them has ten dollars for shipping, and is twenty dollars, but the other one is thirty dollars with free shipping. I'm going to buy the $30 one because I'm getting free shipping. You're saving some type of money, though. I'm saving money because the shipping is free. Girl math. That's girl math. Okay, Caesar said this, right? He said that he helped this one girl. She was trying to buy, like, the big tube of Aquaphora. And she said, oh, this is $8. I don't want to get it um, because it's too expensive. I was like, okay, cool. Then he said that she went to go get the small tube of Aquaphora and then bought a Red Bull on top of it. It came out to like eight dollars and like fifty cents. She saved money. She saved so what much kinda, money. What kind of no? Go to school. <laughs> <laughs> you, you need to go. Y'all need to go to school if y'all doing this type of math. I ain't gonna lie to you. But look, do you, do your girl math and everything. But if I don't, if I don't got triple digits in my account, I consider myself broke. Can I That's say boy I math? Yeah, explain boy math. Boy math is like um, you're talking to a guy. And um, you've literally been talking for, like, maybe a week. He's never asked you, like, any questions about yourself ever. And he's like, oh, my God, I think I'm falling for you. But, like, he doesn't even know anything about you. That's boy math. <laughs> How you boy a girl explain, explaining boy math, though? Hold on. That's a well, do you, do you know boy math? Well, that's not boy math. Honestly, that's just uh, desperate math. Honestly, personally. Because it seems I'm like you're just a desperate boy and you want some type of love and you're trying to fall in love with somebody because no, you can't find that love anywhere. That's boy math. That's desperate that's math. That's basic boy math. That's messing with I seen, dummies. Boy. <laughs> I seen this thing on threads. Speaking of that topic, I seen this thing on threads. It was like a screenshot of the text messages. You were like, oh, hi. And then you said, hi. And then it said, are we dating? <laughs> what? No, why are guys like that? What? What? what my name is. <laughs> what happened to hi? Hello. My name is. <laughs> they need to get packed up then. My favorite color is green. At that point, if you're dealing with a dude like that, just leave him on red. Right? Don't no, even just, respond back. Yeah, that's funny. So, are we dating? He said, oh my God, are we dating? Hmm? What? <laughs> hmm. He think that W is. That's what he thinks it is. No. no. <laughs> Not through no. the text messages. I have another example of boy math. Go ahead, explain. You, um, he'll be talking to you and he's like messing with other people. But if you tell him you're messing with other people, then you're in the wrong. <laughs> that's boy math. Okay, that's narcissistic math. <laughs> I prefer girl math. <laughs> I as well prefer girl math. It's more down to earth. Girl math is also when you're like driving and let's say you like hit a curb or like hit a piece of like something in the road. You get out and look and the car does like there's no damage. I'm like, if the car didn't feel it, I didn't feel it. Girl math. Nothing happened. Yeah, I didn't hit anything. Mm -hmm. And the curb just likes to come at you and be like, yeah. Who put that curb there? The curb hit me. That that is very true. On like real 
like on everything else that's it's true the curb hit me yes. not to lie i'm like a great driver but the curb did hit me yes it does especially when you're driving home at night it just likes to be like yeah and you're like bro really <laughs> it like, does it just jumps out of you like I, it just jumps at you out of nowhere thank you kai thank you for agreeing although, donovan although it never hits me though <laughs> yeah my um my truck has seen better days <laughs> what i get not nah, for real yeah 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 like yeah for real That's you've never great. had a curb hit you ever i've hit a curb oh, I have you've hit the wow that's so mean that's it fine is. that's a fine <laughs> yeah well find me oh well find me send me to court send me, send me to jail oh, oh. oh it, it's not that deep it's just like you gotta pay 200 dollars. Oh. take it take my money i'll have it not you. Can I take the car? No. Can I have like you the air fresheners? Nothing. You can't have nothing. <laughs> the black nothing. ice? Never mind. Ooh. I don't got black ice in my car. Now the strawberry one? Y'all, that one's... The cherry one? Like the cherry like wax smell? <laughs> oh, I was talking about like air fresheners like for the car. The strawberry one? Yeah. There's like... Okay. There's like melty ones for the car too. You put in like the clip holder, it melts. Really? Yeah, like... Yeah. But like it's in like a little cup. It's like in a little like silver like Altoids tin. Mm. Speaking of cups, can we talk about what is so popular about Stanley cups? Vanessa, answer. What is so popular about that? Because what's so great about them? Yeah, I think it's more. Um, you're buying the brand. They just really took off. It's literally like the 2018 um, hydro flask epidemic when everyone wanted a hydro. It's just the new hydro flask, honestly. But like, I feel like we've grown up a little bit. So now like the standing is like the grown girl hydro flask. Cause a hydro flask is like such like a, like a swing, like, yeah. Like you could hit, like really like get someone with that. But like a standing is like, I'm like, <laughs> Uh, Stanley's more like I'm a woman and like I need a sip of water or like people will be putting their whole diet coke in there like they'll run to the gas station put their whole diet coke or like their coffee but I feel like it's like the grown girl hydro flask and like they have different like aesthetic colors that aren't like bright and like childish they have like muted colors that like I guess are like more more aesthetic to the to the older mm. audience it's giving soccer mom like really like they're like in their big old Yukon SUV yeah, they're and they're just like sure like it's still a drink like a fun cup for like them it's giving big gulp with a handle that's what it's giving but what's cheaper hydro or mm, there's like well there's different sizes for each of them and they're like prices may vary but how like, many stanley's do you have i have two two what colors um they're both green one's like a tie-dye green and i got it when it first came out and this other one is like a dark like forest green you so two? you spent i only have two you spent a hundred dollars uh for two cups yeah yeah but um i got one like it was like a six month span difference but i'm a sucker for anything green do you think it was worth the the hype yeah i really like them you think so i really do like them then what type of stanley do you have kai i don't have a stanley i got a stanley dupe stanley dupe from five below and it still does the same thing maybe the stanley like holds the temperature at a steady rate longer but it's like the same it's the exact same thing basically you're just buying a brand like be for real and anyone that buys anything expensive is buying brand you're buying the nike shirt because it has the swoosh on it you're buying you're buying like anything you're buying starbucks because it's starbucks like you can make coffee at home but you're buying a brand you can you can buy the air force ones but go to target and get our class and it's the same thing no they're not no it's them the same thing fall, them things will fall apart within two days two to three business days they look days. exactly the same like i really couldn't tell a difference go buy a pair no see <laughs> see that's what i'm saying i don't like go air force hair. i don't like air forces to begin with have you ever seen me wear a pair of air forces yes air forces yes nike air forces yes. i have never owned a pair of nike <laughs> air like forces keep, yes <laughs> when girl i see everything you I've never worn a pair of Nike Air Forces in my entire <sighs> life. All right, man. You've caught Donovan lying on camera. I don't lie on camera. On I just speak the truth, the whole tape. truth, and nothing but the truth. She wears Air Forces. I really don't. I'm more of a Converse or like Samba type, type gal. A van? A Samba. <laughs> okay, I have a lot of questions for Vanessa for real. So I feel like this was like yeah, it was a podcast for you. Like, it was just kind of like I'm like cornered. No, you're not even cornered. It was just kind of like <laughs> I 
I didn't know Kyle was gonna pull up like that at the I'll time. Like, just know, like, if I'm coming, he's coming. Just like know at that point, you know. Kai, I, well, Kai literally texted me and said, "Oh yeah, uh, I want to walk my dog." And I said, "You could pull up if you want to pull up, but um, I if you don't, it's all good." Low key, I already knew he's coming. We're talking no, about it. No, I just say anything because I didn't say anything just because I didn't know what time we're actually gonna take no, I'm her. Not, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about her. I feel like you should assume that like if I'm there, Kai's gonna be there. Like we're a package deal at this point. Like we're a two for one. Oh y'all lame. <laughs> yes, we are. What's your first question for her? Yeah. So, can you explain the logic behind girls crying and they're recording themselves? No, because I've never done that. I'm not saying you've done it. I'm asking you, like, because I know you might have friends that have done that before. I feel like women are very emotional and they're really in touch with their feelings. So, filming yourself crying is just another form of, like, letting it out and this sign of, like, self-soothing and it's therapeutic. At least what I've gotten from it. Like recording yourself too? Yeah, because it's just like a memory to look back on because like we can take ourselves out of the moment and be like, this, I'm going to look so silly in like, in like literally a week. I'm going to look back and be like, what was I crying for? <laughs> like, I'm such a goof for that, <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. Would you ever do that? Um, or do you have some in your memories? I have that you like do? a photo. I've never f actually like filmed myself crying because like I have a lot of feelings mm -hmm. and like it's really intense. But maybe I've like snapped a flick when I was like younger and me like crying over something dumb. Yeah. But like you know it's dumb, but you have to let it out. Yeah, type stuff. What about you, Kai? Have you ever done that? Mm hmm. I have. But I haven't posted it. I just don't like when, like, I think, yeah. It's for the memes. Like, just for yourself, though. But then I delete it because of Wolf Fort. Why is it in my camera Wolf Fort? I think it's so funny when I look back. I'm like, you, because, like, you're going to look back and be like, what was, what was I even crying for? What was that booger bubble for? Oh, booger, you're crying that hard where you're like, can't <laughs> breathe. Sister Tashima, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. No way. <laughs> 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 Oh, gross. That's Eek. disgusting. That's my answer so how'd you for go? that. Yeah, dude. What you mean, my boy? Gas to see it through my Oh, no. Nah. <laughs> uh -uh. <laughs> okay, next question. So, do you guys hate it when uh, people give you mixed signals when it comes to someone liking you? I do hate it, but also if I get more than one mixed signal, best believe, like, it's October. It's spooky season. I'm a ghost. Oh, I'm a ghost. Like, I'm not. <laughs> it's uh. spooky season, ghost and bleeding. <laughs> Cut the mic. <laughs> Hold on, the silence in the room got crazy. It was just so silent. Everybody just looked at each other like, <laughs> like, who gonna laugh first? <laughs> Cut the mic. You just see John's side. I just. I was like, I was like, who gonna laugh first? And it's nobody spooky laughed. season, ghost and ladies. <laughs> okay, so you hate mixed signals when it comes to that, like somebody liking you. I strongly dislike them. Do you feel like you throw mixed signals here and there too? Of course, of course, but of course. <laughs> I almost called you the N word. Let me calm down. Um, oh. <laughs> nah, I'm playing. I don't really send mixed signals, but like. If you send mixed signals, I will match the energy for a second. Just to see if, like, if you're going to figure it out. If you don't, then um, best believe I'm going ghost. But, like, I'm just going to tell you straight point blank, period. I'm like, hey, I just want to talk. Or, like, hey, I like you. Or, like, we should hang out. Like, well, you hear that, man. So, if you want to hit a Moonbeam Popsicle, she doesn't send mixed signals or anything. She shoot up flares. That's what she's ready to do. Yeah, I'm She just... loves you. She wants you. Oh. Real talk. So, if you want to talk about... to her, go ahead and hit her up. Moonbeam Popsicle. <laughs> I'll put it down. Link in the description. Oh. Thanks. I got you. You're so thoughtful. I try my best. Huh? <laughs> I try my best too. What about you, Kai? Hostile work environment. What'd you say? Do you hate it when people give you mixed signals when it comes to liking somebody? I don't hate it because I've I've grown to the point where like if you're just gonna give me a big signal, well, why? Yeah. I'm not gonna waste my time. Like yeah. if you wanna if you wanna put in effort, cool, you can. I don't mind too if you were like give me mixed signals and then text me like two months from now it's like you can still text me but it just depends on what i feel at that moment and what i sense and then if it's like good vibes i'm gonna text you back if it's yeah. bad vibes and i might still text you back but just like on some petty friend stuff